Hi everybody, Miss Jenny here from the Flossmore Library. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to Steam at Home. Um, this is our second week of doing our Steam at Home kit, uh, kits. I hope you guys um, enjoyed the first one. So today I brought you guys um, Steam at Home kit yarn and foil relief. Um, so you guys are gonna get a bag of a cardboard piece, foil, um, some yarn, more than this, um, a little glue, um, you guys can keep this, you can keep it at home for our next project, um, and then the yarn will come like this, so you get a couple different colors, and, um, what you'll have to supply at home is permanent markers, um, and a pencil, and then also sandpaper, you guys might not want to use this, you could if you want to. All right, so this um, this craft is, uh, or this take home steam kit, um, is pretty simple. Um, you just have to be patient with the drying time. So I'm gonna show you guys what we're gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna scoot you guys down a little bit here so you can see what I'm doing. There we go. All righty, so I have the cardboard piece here so you can take a pencil or a pen and you can make designs on your cardboard piece like so okay and then you're gonna trace with the glue your shapes and this is not working, but your guys will, I promise. So <laughs> we'll trace the glue. We'll trace it here. Oh, there's a stopper on there. That's smart. So make sure there's a little protective thing on there for you guys. Didn't know. All right, trial and error, right? <laughs> All righty. So there we go. We scoot it around. All right, so you have one here. We're gonna take your yarn and put it around. Some you might need to cut. This one will probably cut, but we're not gonna cut it for the sake of the video here, guys, okay? All righty, so. After this is dry, I would let this dry for maybe a half hour or so. Um, and then you can also add whatever design you want on here. And then you're gonna take the foil, once it's dry, um, you're gonna cover it. And then on the back side, I'm gonna show you the one that I already did. On the back side, you're just gonna tape it closed so it stays on there, okay? This is one I already did. So once you put the foil on there, you're gonna feel and see the the yarn through the foil. And then I just need you to guys to push it down, push it down. You can put a little glue on the back side of this of the cardboard before you put the foil down. Forgot that step. But you guys will have instructions on here on the piece of paper with your kit. And this is how it will turn out once you once it dries and you can see it's like 2d it's pretty cool and then you can start coloring with the permanent markers anywhere that you want i would stay not on the on the yarn because it looks kind of cool that it's 3d or if you wanted to you can do black on the the yarn impression that'd be cool too but yeah um so this is a simple craft i think it looks really cool it's like almost like stained glass and you can make any kind of designs that you want and then also i gave you the sandpaper just in case you wanted to you know make it a little rough around the colors you know just to but you don't have to but you could Alrighty. 
And once you're done, it'll be a cool piece to hang up and put on your fridge. You can add some magnets to the back, put it on your fridge, or you can put it in a frame and put it in your room. So, all right. Well, thank you guys so much. Um, I'll see you guys in July for our third uh, steam kit to take home. Alrighty. And uh, I will see you guys at the library. All right. Bye.